Hi, good morning everyone. Welcome to Kotak Securities Weekly Fundamental Podcast. This is Vinny Mehta. Last week, Nifty lost 1.1%, while Sensex was down around 1.3%. BSC Midcap and Small Cap outperformed with gains of around 0.4% and 0.3% respectively. If you see Indian stock markets remain concerned about growth prospects even as inflation continued its downward trajectory both globally and domestically global stock markets remained volatile as market participants continued to seek clarity on the evolving growth inflation balance and indian equity markets were circumspect as they absorbed the weak earnings sprint of major it companies fourth quarter results now during the last week if you see foreign investors activity fii's continued to be net buyers to the tune of rupees 317 crores uh, so far in april month fii flows are expected to remain volatile now given the concerns about the inflation now fpi flows uh, uh, for emerging market so far in april uh, were uh, mixed except for taiwan and thailand all other emerging markets witnessed inflows now coming to the stock picks for the week we like icici prudential uh, we have a buy rating on the stock with fair value or target of rupees 610 icici prudential life reported strong performance in fourth quarter with 26% annual premium equivalent Uh, growth and 36% value of new business growth supported by sale of high value non linked products in the last two months of the quarter lower drag from icici bank and push in lower ticket non linked business will drive business volumes over medium term despite drag of lower hni business so uh, we expect investments Uh, investments in growth to moderate to value of new business margin expansion we raise the estimates and retain buy on the stock uh with fair value as i said at rupees 610 lastly our pick of the week is clean science and technologies um Clean Sciences, uh, if you see third quarter results, surprised positively on better than expected margins, which staged their sharp recovery, their first sharp recovery after heavy erosion in the preceding year and a half. The demand and growth outlook for the company remains positive, with new products and capacity expansions expected to drive rapid growth in the coming years. competitive risks do exist in the stock but we find valuations more realistic now and upgrade to add rating with a fair value or target of rupees 1600 so guys that's all from my side this week thank you see you again next week signing off